Governor Nikki Haley is out with a new political ad blasting her Democratic opponent in the governor's race. In the ad called Truth, Haley tries to conquer claims that have been made by Vincent Shaheen. But does the governor's new ad stand up to our truth check test? Here is WIF News 4 Investigates Tim Walsh. He's running false ads to hide the truth about himself. This ad by Republican Nikki Haley was released just this week. Five days after Democrat Vincent Shaheen released his ad attacking Haley's ethics. This is the incumbent governor's rebuttal. Seen liberal Vince Shaheen's negative ads against Nikki Haley? Independent analysts call Shaheen's attacks misleading and hiding key facts. Governor Haley's ad claims independent analysts call Shaheen's attacks on her misleading and hiding key facts. What it's referring to is an August 26 article on factcheck.org that talks about the huge data breach two years ago at the South Carolina Department of Revenue. Vincent Shaheen, in one of his own political ads, criticized the governor for not telling the public sooner. But the fact check article says Governor Nikki Haley did exactly what federal law enforcement officials asked her to do. That is, hold off on telling the public so investigators could make some headway in the case. In that sense, a key fact in Shaheen's ad was left out, making Haley's claim that his ad was misleading true. Vince Shaheen is a trial lawyer who's made big bucks defending violent criminals and suing our state. While this statement is true, there is more to the story, as we learned the last time Haley made this claim about her opponent. While Shaheen is a trial lawyer and has defended violent criminals according to court records, he is also a former prosecutor who's held criminals accountable. Now, back in April, when the pro-Haley Republican Governors Association aired an ad attacking Shaheen for being a trial lawyer, the South Carolina Bar Association was outraged and said criminal defense lawyers have a professional duty to ensure their client gets a fair trial. And his plans call for hundreds of millions in new spending. This statement in the governor's ad is misleading because it's based upon things Shaheen wrote about in his self-published book such as investing in roads, increasing the number of state troopers in South Carolina, and giving more money to technical schools. But Shaheen's campaign says the Haley camp left out the part from his book where he talks about saving money by reducing industrial and commercial property taxes and abolishing local property taxes. Tim Waller reporting for us there. Now coming up in our next Truth Check, an explosive ad from North Carolina Senate hopeful Tom Tillis. The Republican candidate slams the incumbent Kay Hagan on matters of national security. And be sure to check out our other Truth Check reports. Just head to our website and click on Politics under the News tab on WYF.